Those are silica sand, which is the glass, uh, clay, which helps it actually adhere to clay bodies, and fluxes. And so a flux is a uh, material that takes the temperature, the melting temperature of clay and silica, and brings them down to a temperature that we can do in our kilns, which is still extremely hot. Cone 10 in our uh, kilns is about 2100 degrees. And so what I did for this test was I completely took out strontium carbonate, which is a flux in the glaze, and then slowly uh, added it back into a predetermined glaze recipe to see how strontium uh, changes the way that a, a glaze looks, feels, texture, and the hardness on a clay body. Um, if you look here, um, you can even see the difference between the fish scale versus when you have a ton of strontium in it, which has this cake-like glaze fit. Uh, the reason why there were so many test tiles uh, to just this test alone, which is only one out of the, I think, six that I did, was because I wanted to make sure that I did both a white clay body and a dark clay body to make sure that the glaze looks good on both clay bodies since they change different. They change so vastly, um, especially with our darker clays tend to have iron in them and can affect the way that glaze is colored.